Hello. What's up guys? So today we are going to go to Sea Life Aquarium in Apopka to go grab some uh, live black worms and let's see what they have in stock. I have to uh, stop by Petco to go grab um, a aquarium too. So let's go. Follow me this way. First stop, here we go, let's go inside. Let's go see what they have for me. So, you guys will see, I got a pretty good uh, deal on this one since I had um, some credits in this store. All right, let's go. From Beta. All right, made it back out, guys. So I got a five gallon. So this five gallon was on sale for seventeen dollars, but I had um uh, <clears throat> I had ten dollars in um was it Pell Rewards points, so total was only seven dollars. So that was a pretty good deal. I had to use it before uh, my points expires too. So ten dollar in points. So I got this five gallon for seven bucks. Pretty good deal. And um, I got those points from uh, buying uh, all my aquariums from um, their uh, Petco's um, one dollar per gallon sale. So that was pretty nice. Turn those points to redeem it for this little thing. All right. On to the next store. Let's go. All right, guys, we made it. That was a long drive. That was about 30 minutes. So many crazy people on the road. All right, let's go outside. They got a nice bandage shark in here. Pretty nice. All right, I made it back out, guys. Guess what I got? Let's open this. We got some shrimp, guys, some shrimpies. All right, we'll see you guys at home. All right, guys, made it back home. So that was a... Uh, that was an okay trip. I went over there for live black worms, but unfortunately they ran out. So um, I just decided to grab some red cherry shrimps. And I don't know, shoot, man, I wish they had some uh, uh, some live black worms because my beta fish, man, they love live black worms and it makes them go so fast, but I guess they they said um there should be a shipment today later on today but we'll see I'll call them later on see if they have any but yeah Sea Life Aquarium that is my go-to uh, local fish store uh, it's a mom and pop shop it's been um in a popka for a while it's um 
family owned they're super nice they are super duper nice very knowledgeable and I love that place I could stay in there for hours on end and not even get bored I love that place all right let me show you guys the shrimp all right so I grabbed this five gallon for seven dollars and my shrimps are in here so let me take out the receipt Boom. Let's hope I have some males in here. It looks like they're mostly females. Boy, I think there's a male in here. All right, let's toss them in. Sorry about the blurriness. So let them acclimate for a bit. And my car was kind of cold because I had the AC on. So let them acclimate for a bit. So they're pretty red. More like a Bloody Mary red. This one that is really clear, kind of clear. So I might have to um, call that one. I don't even uh, choose these um, shrimps. They just um, chose it for me. So There's like one, two, three females and two males. Supposed to be six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh yeah, there's, there's six. All right, so they are going into this five gallon. I had a bed on here, but yeah, I just put a whole bunch of moss in here, and then I just turned it into my going white cloud minnow tank. There's a whole bunch of them. Uh, moss, java moss. There's different kinds of moss in here. I'm not quite sure what they all are. All right, let's give you guys a better shot here. So a whole bunch of moss. That should be good for the shrimps. Hopefully the fish won't be picking on the shrimp too much. Take another look, guys. Man, I like the red on them. It's really deep. It's like a Bloody Mary. Alright guys. We'll check back again once they're done acclimating.
All right, let's see if we can find the shrimps. All right, I see one right there, swimming back there to the right. Uh, one is hiding in here. Kind of see him or her. And the color is just getting darker. I love it. They're like uh, Bloody Marys. Hmm, let's see. All right, there's one right here. Uh, see if I can focus. He doesn't want to focus. There's just so much glare in this room that I can't really get a good video at all. There's, I think that one's a male on that rock right there. Um, let's go over here to the side. Right there. This one looks like a male. It's like a Sakura red. It's like all sorts of red in here. Well, here's one back here behind the sponge filter. Man, nothing. No, this thing doesn't want to focus at all. But yeah. Oh well, yeah, these guys turn out to be pretty red, pretty dark, pretty good quality uh, red cherry shrimps, and um, I'm happy. I hope you guys like it too, guys. These are pretty nice. Nani? Bruh. Alright guys, so that's gonna end the video. Um, I wanna thank you guys for coming along with me. And I also wanna thank you guys for liking my videos and subscribing. Uh, really means a lot to me. Um, although we didn't get our uh, light black worms to feed our betas in here. We still got like some nice shrimps so that's all good and um I think that's it. So I guess this video is gonna end and again don't forget to like and subscribe. Alright, until next time. See ya.